I think not only is it unusual to get the three tiers together, but I think it's unusual to get, you have government officials here, you have legislators here, you have uh, prevention groups here. So I think that is the unique aspect of this, that truly all, all stakeholders are represented at this forum. It was uh, designed to get a broad group from the different players in the industry, from distributors to the state regulators to health professionals, uh, retailers, uh, legislators, and see if we could find some common ground for the next legislative session and really put together a well thought uh, agenda for the state here to help improve uh, the overall industry. First, you know, this is pretty unprecedented to see all these different stakeholders in one uh, space having this dialogue. And I was just thinking, what a great situation. I mean, this could be replicated in other states. I mean, everyone I talked to this morning was a really, really reasonable person. No one seemed to come in with a, with a, a cast iron agenda, like a bull in a china shop. And I think that bodes well. I, I think the whole concept of this meeting to begin with is pretty unique and interesting. I think this conversation and bringing the stakeholders together has been a very effective way of communicating. It's great to have all kinds of people from the industry and all the different silos here to kind of talk about challenges and concerns and what's working, what's not. I think the dialogue's been great and um, somewhat unexpected that there's a lot more common ground than I think many of us expected. I think the conversations that we had today were constructive and helpful toward advancing things in the future. I think the takeaways is that, you know, you learn what everybody is dealing with in their industry and clearly there are some areas of opportunity for us all to work better, more collaboratively and, and make some changes that will help the industry overall. Well, I think it was a great opportunity to learn more about the entire alcohol distribution system in the state, from the processors, the producers, uh, to the distributors, to the manufacturers, and to the retailers. That's very important to see that whole package come together and how that interacts with the Liquor Commission. And how do we continue to have this sort of collective communication and collaboration when it comes to you know, our common, common issues, which are sort of regulating beverage alcohol in, in New Hampshire? We can all agree on that. I think we all agree on tourism and sort of economic development and bringing more people to the state. So I think we can sort of put our issues that we don't agree on the side and focus on the big picture and, and create some value. I think today was a good first step for everyone and kind of getting everything out on the table. So I think as long as we continue dialogue and push things forward, then it will end up better for the state and consumers.